Hello, this is Jeremy. In this episode of Video Gamers Oasis, video game handbook reading, we've been reading the Minecraft construction handbook. And we started off with page 32 of Building a Royal Hall. We're continuing it on on page 34, part two of the chapter. We're just reading steps three and four, but this is very, these are very crucial, important steps in building your royal hall in Minecraft. Stay tuned. Video Gamers Oasis presents Video Game Handbook Reading with Jeremy. Hello gamers, Minecrafters, YouTubers, and YouTube crosswatchers. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Video Gamers Oasis. I'm your host, Jeremy, in my Sonic the Hedgehog Minecraft skin, my alternate reality version of myself. Hope you're doing well. And during this tumultuous time, eating healthy, resting, and uh, rejuvenating. We're gonna get through this, uh, this ordeal with, right now with our quarantine. Just letting you know that I'm doing okay. And continuing on on um, my video game, uh, my video game Minecraft handbook reading of the Minecraft Construction Handbook by Mojang and Eggman. You can get the book yourself by downloading the Amazon link below. We're also uh, I just want to let you know um, we we've been reading about um, page thirty two. We've we've been reading the first two steps of the Royal Hall. I'm breaking this up in not only into two videos, but to three videos. Uh, there's a, as, the, as we advance further in this book, there is a lot more uh, complicated uh, building projects that we're going to do, and they're going to be longer and more detailed, so I will require several videos for each chapter. We're on page 34, and we're just going to be reading steps three and four for today. I need to pace myself and learn to rest. And not uh, do everything in one sitting. We will also do uh, steps five to eight another day. So we're working on the Royal Hall in, on page 34 and we're going to continue on our building project and show you how to do that. Before we do that, please like this video, add it to your favorites, leave comments below, share with your friends, social media, tell your friends about what the projects I'm doing and the videos I'm doing on this YouTube channel. Click the subscribe button if you have not already and click that notification bell. Make sure it's wiggling so I can be notified and you can be notified of new videos that I will be uh, uploading in the future. So yeah, check out the uh, Amazon uh, link for purchasing the book yourself, the Minecraft Construction Handbook. Let's get on with the rest of the building. Step three. Fill the walls with cobblestone, or in this case, I'm using I'm using sandstone uh, blocks to create like a a terracotta throne room because this is in a terracotta like a, a uh, desert realm in the Minecraft world. But you can use basically anything you prefer. You can use cobblestone. You can use uh, uh, you know sandstone. It's whatever works for you to make it look uh, attractive. So moving on to the uh, actual book, what it says here. So you can use cobblestone and the windows with glass panes. Add fence blocks with torches on top to light up the room. Now create your throne, making sure it's fit for Minecraft royalty. Think gold, diamond, and anything else that might bling it up. So it's starting to come together uh, piece by piece. My throne room is, is starting to look really attractive here. And um, the, 
the the uh, throne the th actual throne is uh, kind of um, kind of fancy. I've uh, I've made sort of like a terracotta stone sandstone uh, throne with uh, steps on the top, and they have some a gold cross with the center, a, a, a diamond in the center. And I've also put some purple uh, stained glass on the back of the throne and a glowstone at the very top. And Step number four, add stone pillars to your throne room for a really authentic touch. The pillars in our example are two by two blocks wide and the same height as the walls. We also added a stone brick pattern to the floor to create some detail. I'm pretty proud of what I did so far. Really nice, made some nice attractive pillars uh, made of sandstone brick and I've also added some steps on the bottom of each uh, pillar there's four steps on each side of the pillar to add a certain um, <laughs> a certain Gre Greco-Roman appearance like a bottom of the pillar of a Greco-Roman pillar even though it's not Greco-Roman it has that kind of sort of that flair on the bottom of the pillar of each one and it looks really attractive and fancy Okay, that's all the time we had for this episode of the uh, Minecraft Video Game Video Gamers Oasis uh, Construction Handbook Reading with Jeremy, and we uh, will be continuing another episode after this one of uh, Steps 5 to 8 of the Royal Hall. That will be finishing this chapter. <laughs> so I'm breaking it up in pieces so I can, you know, you know, the saying goes, how do you eat a, how do you eat an elephant, how do you eat an elephant? one bite at a time. So I'm taking it piece by piece, not little elephant, of course. I'm using analogy and metaphor. So we'll continue on another day. Make sure to like this video if you have not already. Add it to your favorites. Leave comments below. I appreciate your feedback. If you found this video series helpful or at least enjoyable, entertaining, let me know links below. And subscribe to Video Gamers Oasis to be notified of the latest videos. And uh, VideoGamersOasis.com is being developed. Just taking a little, taking some time, taking a break from the developing. It is coming along step by step. So check it, check it in from time to time. The progress is being made. And also, I work with Brave, the Brave browser. Make sure to download the Brave browser with the link below. And uh, you, you, by doing that, by downloading the Brave browser and downloading your bats, you'll be helping my project, uh, helping me getting, you know, getting some digital tokens, BATs. For the hard work that I do, and you could do you could do the same for yourself for your YouTube channel, your website. You can sign up for Brave and get digital tokens to reward you for your hard work. Because I I do believe everybody, all YouTubers, all website designers who work hard on their projects, they deserve their just desserts. That's all we have time we have. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again real soon. Take care of each other. Take care of yourselves. And we'll see you again bright and early next time. The third installment of the World Hall next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. Video Gamers Oasis presents Video Game Handbook Reading with Jeremy. Free MIDI Music Album Classical Archives Collection Johann Sebastian Bach Harpsichord Sonata in D BWV 963 Harpsichord Sonata in D comma, BWV, 
0.963 28 kilobytes https colon forward slash forward slash triple w dot classical archives dot com library desktop wallpaper source http colon forward slash forward slash git wallpapers dot com forward slash collection forward slash library dash background dash images video gamers oasis website youtube channel if you enjoy the content on this youtube channel please download the brave browser https colon forward slash forward slash brave dot com forward slash vid two six eight as well you can donate your bats and watch the brave ads thank you <laughs>